Hey guys, I'm Salwa. Uh, on Instagram, I'm at yourgalsal underscore. And today we're going to be doing a full face of makeup um, with Superdrug's best-selling products on their website. So guys, I'll be doing my eyebrows first and I'll be using the MUA Eyebrow Pencil in Brunette. I try to keep my brows quite light and fluffy. I don't really want to do like a whole Insta brow. I'm just going to brush that through. And then I'll use the brush and just make sure that it's like super diffused. I started doing makeup, you know, just normally, probably at the age of like 13, 14, when I started going to secondary school because I was surrounded with, with a lot more girls who did makeup and I was just like, ooh, I want to be a part of that. The like Maybelline's um, mascaras were actually one of my first makeup purchases from Superdrugs. So actually this eyebrow pencil is actually really good. It's really creamy and I really am liking the way it's applying. The next thing that I do is um, I have to clean up my brows so it just gives it a more effortless uh, snatched look. Um, and what I do with this is I use concealer. So today I'm going to be using the NYX Can't Stop One Stop Concealer. While that sits, I'm gonna do my foundation. What I'm gonna start off with is the Revolution Ultra Face Base Primer. And essentially what it does is it gives you 24 hour protections. Everyone should know what this is. It's the Revolution Foundation Stick. This is a game changer. It's so creamy uh, and it blends really nice on the skin. The good thing about uh, the Revolution Foundation is that if you wanna build it, you can. So if you need something that's a lot more uh, long wear but a lot more high coverage then you can just go ahead and add some more wherever you need it I'm gonna move on to my concealer and I'm gonna go back to the can't stop won't stop um, NYX concealers, but I've got two shades um, We're gonna start off with the darker shade just because I need to kind of correct and conceal my under eyes because I have darker bags and then we'll go ahead and we'll highlight and bring light to the face with the lighter concealer But with this one, I'm just gonna dot it I love doing my makeup, it's so relaxing. Like people hate doing this and I'm just like, why? Honestly, it's like therapeutic for me. It's sort of like getting yourself, it's like putting your armor on, but not hiding yourself. Does that make sense? You're just sort of prepping yourself for the day because how you feel about yourself is how everyone else is gonna feel about you, right? Um, I'm taking the lighter shade and I'm just gonna go a little bit more heavy with this one. For me, it's really personal. It's nice to get ready with, in a room with other people, but also like doing my makeup, like that's my time to get, in, like, get to know me and to just really have that space and that energy just to do my own thing, you know? But on the other side of things, like I have friends who are makeup artists and like I, I love them coming over and like using my face as a canvas or me like sharing and using their face as a canvas because we're in this safe space of like, sharing our creativity with each other. Cool, so that's blended out. The next thing I'm gonna take is the Rimmel Radiant Brick. So it's a shimmer powder, and essentially it's there to add some color to your face and some dimension. So obviously like I watch like makeup YouTubers like Jackie Aina, Nikki Tutorials, or Jaclyn Hill, like you know all the big names, the big names now, you know? And then obviously as I grew, I kind of find, found more artists, like makeup artists than influencers. So before I start to do my eyes, uh, I'm gonna be setting my face a little bit just because we have the concealer and stuff like that. And I'll be using the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop setting powder. I don't personally like to have to like matted down face just because I talk like crazy if you can't tell and I'm, I do a lot of stuff with my face. Make sure that you tap out like your creases because you don't want to set creases you want to try and blur that out so just use your finger and just light sweep. Next step is um, highlighter so I'm going to be doing I do my base and I do my foundation uh, like I do my foundation highlighter and blush and stuff like that first and then I move into eyes. I don't know why but I'll be taking the NYX Away We Glow Liquid Booster. But you take a little, I'm just gonna dot it, grab maybe like a fan brush, or even, I'll take this brush, this is good. I'll just do it like one section at a time. So this is how the highlighter looks. And we're basically moving into blusher, so that's my favorite. Um, I'm gonna be taking the MUA Blushed Matte Blush Powder. And then I've done my cheeks, but I'm gonna literally take some and I put it on my nose. But yeah, so there's, the, there's our base. 
So um, I'm going to be doing my eyes now um, and I'll be taking the MUA uh, eyeshadow palette in Elysium. Like say the night before, I'll have like a light bulb moment where I'm just like, yeah, I really want to try this. And you know, it'll either be like a color or a shape or just a design or something that I saw. And in my head, it will look amazing because in my head I have like Bella Hadid's face. Um, and then IRL, then that's when like the, the working with the makeup happens. I'm gonna then take, so that's that. And I'm just gonna take it on my under eyes as well, just a little bit. And then I'm gonna take the NYX concealer again and use it just to create a lighter base for the halo part of my eye. And I can see why this is like a bestseller because honestly, it's just multi-use. You can use it as an eyeshadow primer, you can use it as your concealer. It works, you know? And I'm just gonna use my finger because doing the halo part is, it's easier just using your finger. And you just tap it and look at that. And I'll just take the excess of what I have on my hands and just like dab it in the inner corner just so there's some more light in my eye. And the eyeliner is from Collection and it's the Fast Strike eyeliner. And so what I do in a lot of my looks, I've been doing it for maybe like the past four years, is I like to add dots right here. So those are my like standard dots and that's using the Collection eyeliner. Um, so the next thing I'm moving on to is my mascara and I'll be using the Maybelline Lash Sensation. So yeah, we'll be using this and essentially all you do is run it up. Mascara has to be, for me, waterproof. The brush has to be nice. So I like this brush because it's curved. Um, it's time to go and finish off with my lips. Uh, and essentially, I'm actually gonna do something sneaky. So I'm gonna use the brow pencil that we just used on my brows um, as my lip liner. Um, because it's a really beautiful chocolatey shade, so I think it'll be really nice when it offsets with the lip, which is uh, Maybelline's Superstay Matte Ink. So we're gonna finish the look now, and the last thing that I'll be doing is applying my lip. So we did outline with the uh, eyebrow pencil from Makeup Academy, um, and now we're gonna just finish off with the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink. This is really heavy duty. <laughs> Just to soften it up, if you get a brush and just use it to stipple it. That's it, that's the look. Using all the best sellers from Superdrug's online store. Thanks for watching guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, please, please, please subscribe to Superdrug's channel um, if you wanna see more content like this uh, and learn how to create some fun looks.